Hello friends and welcome to the channel. This is Stormhaven Gaming, I'm John, and this is Foundation. And we've got ourselves a steward of the bishop, and what's the betting they want herbs, bread and berries? Bread, herbs and berries, look at that. Okay, what have we got? We have more than enough to accommodate their desires. We have 242 berries, which isn't a huge amount, uh, but we do have 439 in total. Um, Herbs-wise, we have 129, we need 50. Bread, 75, we need... Uh, we need 75, we have 368. Yeah, we can do that. That's fine. Ooh! Your high standing with the clergy has inspired some of your villagers, and they wish to build a majestic stained glass masterpiece to honour the occasion. And we get a new trade route unlocked. Okay. So there has to be a maximum number of decorative parts, excluding masterpiece parts. Alright, well, we can have a look at that at some point. Okay, so, first of all, over here, if I can zoom across, there we go, uh, I'm putting in another uh, market stall, so that we can start selling some of the um, uh, common wares that we're producing. So they'll, they'll be going in there. Uh, I've already put one in, where are we, this market here. So we already have a, a common wares stall in this large market in the center of uh, the settlement. Uh, in addition, if we zoom over here, our tavern is complete. Uh, we have it fully stocked with people, um, so we have uh, meals being made, and in theory we have beer being sold, but obviously that's going to require beer being brought all across from wherever it's being produced, which is sort of over there, I think. Um, oh, okay, our market is ready to be set up so we can do that and close that down they'll just go and finish the the last bits right uh, i've put a gate on here and i'm going to put another one where am i going to put another one i think i'm going to put another one just here there we go uh, and once that's constructed i'm going to put a wall in all the way around um, and, and wall in our tavern here. Uh, leave us plenty of space to expand if we need to, which we probably won't. It's a fairly sizable uh, tavern already. Uh, can only serve 34 people, but we don't have any beer at the moment, so that's fine. Yeah, so I'll wait until that is done. Right. Now, what else? How are we doing for everything else? Wood, we're not doing great for. Um... Wheat we're okay for at the moment. Uh, we are just... We're just sowing the next lot. So that's left over from last season. That's good. Flour. Mmm. Cheese. Mmm. Okay. Let's have a look. I don't think we've given ourselves enough a chance uh, to, to build up our stock of cheese. So I'm going to leave that for a little while before I start putting in... Uh, more market stalls to sell the stuff. Right, let's have a look. Oh, our soldiers. We are almost entirely fully trained. Okay, what have we got? We have a difficult mission. Let's go for that one. Um, you're fully trained. You can go. Fully trained. You can go. Uh, yep. You can't. You can. You can. Oh, we got some newcomers arrived. Well, there we go. There's a extreme chance of success already. So let's send a couple more just to be sure. There we go. Um, hello. Hello. We have three unemployed. Right. We can fit in, I think, another farm down here should we need to. Uh, but at the moment, I think we're okay. How are we doing for beer? 159 beer in stock. 100 of which is in there. Right, we need another granary over here to store beer, don't we? Yes, I think we do. Okay, that's fine. Let's stick it over here with these other industrial buildings. There we go. Okay, so I'll spin on until this building work is done. 
Uh, I think I just got a message saying that someone was approaching, but I can't see anyone just yet. No. Okay, right, I'll spin on briefly until things are, uh, are constructed. Well, that was surprisingly quick. That barely took any time at all, and a granary is done. Uh, we have three workers, so I'll put them all in there. We will store beer. We will store, hmm, fish and cheese. And we can't store pub meals. Um, let's store berry brew in there as well. Uh, that way we can expand our service counter, which I think is this one. Yep. Uh, and we can serve, if we stick another building on the back there, we can serve berry brew as well. Yeah, let's do that. Um, just a refined hall. We'll stick it on the back like that. Um, we will bring it up a little bit. There we go. They can access it, so it's not too much of a problem. Uh, we'll also stick an entrance on this side. Have this sort of inner courtyard like that. Um, that's all we need. Doesn't need to be spectacular. It's just a service counter. But we'll put that in there like so. Okay, we're still waiting for this um, polished stone arch to be done. We're waiting for the stones. They are being brought by Dizier, who is on their way now. Excellent stuff. Right. I'll spin on again. Okay, well, it seems like we have a coin surplus. Word is that you managed to gather a fortune akin to the dragons of yore. A tremendous pile of shiny gold coins. Well, here, say, your folk take comfort, knowing they won't lack riches for a long time. Very well, that gives us a 10% happiness bonus for all of our villagers, which is nice. So that brings us up to 103 happiness. Lovely stuff. Right. Still waiting for this uh, uh, polished stone arch to be built. Uh, nearly finished. Uh, I'm also putting in a forester over here. Uh, and I'm going to... That's uh, nearly done, so I might as well do it now. Uh, let's paint up a reforestation area. I oh, Frankly, that whole area there should be fine, shouldn't it? There we go. Let's just mark in that area. Uh, that is already extraction, is it? No, it's not. Okay, we'll mark in an extraction area there as well then. There we go. Right, our stone arch is complete. Let's have a look. I want to get in. Where are we? Tavern wall. There we go. Um, we'll start it there. That's quite a big wall, isn't it? Okay, well, that's fine. We'll, we'll deal with that. We'll bring the wall up. Whoops. Let's do it so I can actually see what I'm doing. There we go. We'll bring the wall up to there. Yeah, that works. Right. Can we... How do we... Curve. Left click on wall section to toggle wall curving. There we go. That's a bit better. Right, we'll move these... Oh, no, 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 no. We'll move these nodes in a little bit. Like so. So it doesn't block that path there. Brilliant. All right. Now, we'll start again here. And we'll come out like so. And let's see. Curve all of this around. Oh, a lush garden masterpiece. The visit of a minstrel in our village centres has got, uh, inspired some of your villagers and they wish to build a lush garden masterpiece to honour the occasion. Ooh, so we get a, a bonus to our splendour. Very well. 200% bonus to splendour. That'll be useful. Oops. Okay, how's that? That's not too bad. I quite like that. Yep, we'll 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 accept that. That's fine. Uh, we'll pop a forester in there. That's good. Close that down. 
We're still waiting for the service counter to be built there. Right. Okay, what is next then? Still not a lot we can do with the military fort, unfortunately. Um, we don't really have any... Thank you. Uh, we don't really have any stuff we can add to the fort to increase its splendor other than just expanding what we have. Um, if we want the stained glass masterpiece, we're going to need to start producing glass. Um, this is the only quartz on the map as far as I can see. Yeah, so if you want glass at any point, we're going to have to come out this way. That's fine. It's not far to go. Uh, the other iron that we want is all the way over there. So we're going to need to figure out the best way to get across there. And I think it's going to be coming out this way over this island. That seems like the, the, the best place. Let's have a look at our territories. What would we need? Oh, typical. Hmm... Okay, that's not ideal, but it's not terrible. Go on, we'll buy that. And we will stick a bridge. How's that look? That doesn't look terrible. We'll bring that end in a little bit there. Um, yeah, and we'll bring that in like that. That's probably fine. Let's get that built. Uh, Planks-wise, we've got 191. We should be okay. I'll spin on. Okay, nearly finished with the service counter here, and I realise I've made a mistake. I should have built a separate service counter rather than just adding on to that one. Yep, so we want to add a service counter. And... Come on. Stop snapping to things. There we go. No, we want it there. There we go. That's fine. That's all we need for that. Uh, so we do have lots of people in there ready to serve beer. We have seven taverners serving beer. We at least have some beer in there now, which is good. And we are selling it. So again, that's good. Um, I don't think I'll put a berry brewery up here. Or should I? Hmm. Can I expand this one? Um... I already have expanded that one. Okay, so we should be able to provide enough berry brew for both. In theory. Okay, so that's the service lounge done there. We'll wait for this new one to be done. Uh, I also put in a little sign just there. Okay, so whilst we're waiting for that to build, I think we want to look to the uh, clergy again. Um, if we have a look at our progression tab for the clergy, we can unlock the hospitium. Mm-hmm. That's often a pain. Um, or the monastic kitchen, herbs and water. Um, we might want to put in some more herb gardens. But let's unlock the monastic kitchen anyway. So, where are we? Where's the... Monastic Garden. I want to add in... Uh, where are I? Did I just pick the right one? Yes, Herb Planters. I'm going to put in... Hmm. Okay, I'm going to start putting in additional Herb Planters along here like so. Um... Four will do for now, I think. So let's get those built. And then we want to look at a monastic... Uh, kitchen. Where are we? Monastic kitchen. There we go. Right. Uh, this is our refectory up here. So I think putting it on the back of here would be probably a good idea. Um, let's get... A modest Hall Miner, I think. Um, and we'll bring that off of the back there. Um, I'd much rather it was... I'll tell you what, no, let's not. Let's not. Let's get ourselves 
a passageway. Are you going to snap to that? There we go. Passageway on the back there. We'll bring it up to the same height. Uh, and then we'll bring a modest hall. No, I want to raise your height. Come on, stay there. A modest hall like so. And we will put a door on it as well. Um... Let's, ha let's have a major modest gate, shall we? On the front there, like that. That will do. Why? What do I need? What else do I need? A chimney. Okay, I need a chimney. Where's the chimney? There's the chimney. Um, and it's got to fit to the side or front of the building, does it? Okay, well, that's fine. We'll bring that up like so. Maybe not quite that far. There we go. Yep, that works for me. Go on, build that. We have some more people. Hello. Hello. Um, how are our soldiers doing? Um, we've got a couple of wounded. We've got lots of fully trained. What have we got? There we go. A difficult mission. You'll do. Uh, fully trained. Fully trained. Fully trained. Fully trained. Fully trained. There we are. There's an extreme chance of success. So we'll send a couple more as well, just so we can get the experience for them. There we go. So we have the service counter changes complete. So that's our beer selling counter. All good. Um, we can assign a resource. So let's get Berry Brew assigned. Okay, I'm going to spin on. Um, I'm going to spin on until this courier gets here, which is only going to be a couple of seconds. There we go. Charging up on their horse. What do you want? Plank surplus for beer. Neighbouring villagers want to trade a surplus of beer gifted by the monks they are tending to. The folks are in desperate need of planks, which you seem to have in fair numbers. Well, what do you need? 250? No. No, sorry, we don't have that many. Okay, I will spin on till the building work is complete then. Well, look at that. We've got another courier. What do you want, courier? Meager trade with Northbury. Poor trade made last season difficult for Northbury, and the abbess would like your monastery to aid them with herbs and berries. She leaves it up to you to decide if you are to sell or donate the supplies as long as it is delivered with haste. Uh, we want 100 berries and 75 herbs. We can do it. Um... That's selling them, or we can donate them. Um, yeah, let's donate them. Why not? There we go. Oh, and we've got some uh, newcomers. Hello, hello. So there we go. We've got a bit of uh, influence there, which is good, because our um, kingdom influence is plummeting at the moment. So we need to do something about that at some point. Um, over here, our bridge is complete, as you can see. Um, I'm putting in a lumberjack over there just to clear out these trees, get us a little bit more wood coming in uh, for the time being. Um, then we'll open up the next section and see where we go there. Let's have a look. What are we looking at? Oh, none of them are great, are they? I mean, if we get that one, at least we can come across and put a bridge in over here. That's probably our best bet. Let's do that. Let's buy that straight away. Uh, and then we'll need to buy... What's the height difference there? I mean, if we buy that, we could build a bridge straight across there, couldn't we? We probably still need to buy this one anyway, though, wouldn't we? For storage and smelters and probably housing as well. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, well, we're not, we'll not buy it just yet. Uh, we'll wait until this lumberjack is, is built. We'll expand their extraction to cover the... Uh, whole island they probably won't be able to reach but we can put in another one once we've got a bit more space and once some of this other building work is complete right we've had a merchant turn up in the village center what do you want wood why didn't you turn up at the uh, never mind uh the king is planning new outposts around the borders one of his merchants noticed your woodcutter camps and wants to make you an offer 
250 wood? No, we don't have enough. Sorry. Okay, so enough of our monastic kitchen is done for it to start employing um, brothers and sisters to work in it, which means those brothers and sisters have come from somewhere else in the monastery. Um, where is that? Oh, beekeepers. We've lost a couple of our beekeepers. Okay, so we need a few more monks and nuns. Uh, let's have a couple of... Nope. One of each. There we go. Um, and we need to promote some of those. Um, which is all the way down the bottom, isn't it? There we go. Uh, you're unemployed, so you're promoted. And you're unemployed, so you're promoted. Okay. So that should give us an extra one in each. We're going to need to obviously do more with that. We need another, what, uh, four brothers or sisters. Uh, we don't have the population to put in there at the moment, so that's fine. Um, our soldiers, I believe, returned. Where are we? I was looking at the right page. There we are. Yeah, so we've got a couple more wounded. Um, still got a fair few fully trained. Well, what's that? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine fully trained. Um... Let's go for a monastic escort. That's only far rather than very far. It won't take as long. Uh, fully trained. Fully trained. Fully trained. Fully trained. Extreme possibility of success. We'll sell Margaret out with them as well. There we go. Go do your thing. Uh, over here. Our lumberjack is in. Uh, I'm also putting in... Um, a warehouse here, obviously to store uh, the logs, so they don't have to carry them all the way across the map. I don't know where the nearest warehouse is, but it's probably oh some distance away. So yeah, that'll be good to to have that in there. Um, probably be wise to store a few things for the common wares and common clothes as well. Probably a, a good idea to put in there as well. So. Do I want a sawmill up here? No, we're doing okay for planks. We're doing okay for planks. Oh, there we go. The warehouse is done. We can put one person in there for now. Uh, and you will be storing... Where are we? Logs. Common clothes. And common wares. There we go. Uh, might as well set that up to store wood as well. Okay. I'll spin on until the monastic kitchen is complete. Right, our monastic kitchen is in. And it is entirely possible that I slightly overestimated how large it was going to need to be. We need 13 cooks. That's a lot of cooks. Um, we don't need them at the moment. That That's fine. Uh, the problem that we have is that we have 38 monastics currently. Uh, and only 40 spaces for them. So we are going to need to increase the size... Uh, of our dormitories. So, I'm going to put... Yeah. I'm just going to... basically put a, a similar sized hall on the end of each one. Like so. Yep, there we go. That looks about right. Okay, so that should increase our um, dormitory size as well. Okay. Next then, we want to set up a bit more industry, I think. Um, we're doing okay for food. Uh, pretty well for food. Um, let's open all this up. Resources across the board. We're doing okay for. Not so much on the, on the boar. We don't have a, a huge amount of boar left over. Um... We're not selling that, are we? No, we're not selling boar. No, we are selling boar meat. Let's, in fact, let's just... whack up the amount that we keep in stock a little bit. Yeah. Okay, right. Let's have a look then. We have 250 milk. We still only have 104 cheese. 
We're going to want to start selling cheese. So let's add in uh, an additional food stall here. Like that. And we can sell some cheese there. And I think we'll do the same with this market over here. We'll add in another food stall down here as well. Like so. There we go. Okay. Now then, how are we doing over here? We're starting to clear a little bit of this. That's good. Right. What do I want to do over here? That's a good question. What is next on our uh, progression? A cooperage. Yep, we could do a cooperage. Um, yeah, let's do a cooperage. Yeah, why not? Let's, let's not mess around. Um, in which case, we will want... A sawmill over here. That's probably in the wrong place, isn't it? No, that's fine. So we want a sawmill over here, and then we can put in a cooperage. Just so. Okay. A fair amount of building work going on now. Uh, I'm going to... Extend our residential... A little bit more this way. Um, I tell you what, let's put in a row of these cypress trees along here. There we go to disguise. Oh, hello! We've achieved a village aspiration. Famous builder with love, care, and a lot of patience, you managed to turn wilderness into a prosperous village, brimming with life. People will remember your name for generations to come. Prosperity of 500. Look at that. Very nice. Oh, and we've got a courier. Where are you? What do you want, courier? Celebrating fishes. There is plenty. Of, there are plenty of fish in storage. And the elders believe your village is due for a fish fair. If you can make sure everyone has a splash in good time... There's a good chance the trading value of this resource will improve. Yeah, let's have a fish fair. Why not? 21 days. We need to keep their happiness um, above 75. It's currently 95. Hopefully we'll be okay. Okay, we can stick a market trader in there. And we are putting cheese in you. And we can close you down. Okay, I'll spin on. Okay, nine days left of the uh, fish fair. We're currently sitting at 115% happiness. So I think we're going to be okay there. Uh, this market is done. Um, we're still waiting for that market to be done. We're still waiting for the cooperage. We're still waiting for the sawmill. And we're still waiting for the monastery. Um, this building work's taking a little bit longer because obviously they're trying to split their attention over all the different things. So I will spin on a bit more, probably till the end of the fair. Don't know that we'll get any of this building work completed before then, but we'll come back at the end of the fair and see how we're doing. Okay, there we go. A merry fair. Fair lived up to expectations. People from all around are spreading good words about your fine craftsmanship and hope to do further business with your village and we got some things. But I didn't get around to it quickly enough. So there you go. Um, uh, our nun dormitory is complete. Um, our monk dormitory is on its way to being complete. Uh, I'm putting an additional fisher's hut. Um, because we are getting some uh, warnings about people not having enough food, which is unfortunate. Uh, and they all seem to be around this area here. Um, so I'm putting in another fisher's hut up here. So we can hopefully increase the amount of fish stored in this warehouse, uh, this market here. That's the idea. We're also running quite low on meat, comparatively. Uh, and obviously we don't have a lot of boar, so I think we're going to need some more hunting ground set up somewhere. Uh, and I was wondering if we should actually decrease the amount of cutting that we've got going on here. 
by a considerable amount. There we go, like so. Oh, we've got our Fisher's Hut built. Let's get someone working in there right away. Uh, we will buy this territory as well. And we will mark... I think a fairly large chunk of this uh, as hunting ground. Like so. And we will pop ourselves in a couple of hunter's huts in there. And I've lost this one already. That's good, isn't it? Um, Come on, where did I put it? Where did I put it? Oh, it's in there somewhere. There it is. There we go. Right. Oh, hello. Okay. I'll spin on again. Okay, and we have a courier. What do you want? Bountiful trade with Northbury. Thanks to your steady trade, last season has been good for your uh, neighbour Northbury. The appreciative abbess negotiated better prices with their merchants who are now ready to offer reduced prices on certain goods at specific times in exchange for increased trade volume. I mean... Uh, nothing really is useful to us at the moment because we're not buying any of this stuff in. Um, let's go with barrels again. Why not? Okay, but if we come over here, our cooperage is in. Yeah, take citizens, but that's fine. We've promoted some people up to work in there. Um... I've changed uh, the second wood storage in this warehouse to iron uh, because this requires iron and tools and planks um, in order to make barrels. Uh, and I'm building a second warehouse here. Uh, and we're going to store, obviously, barrels, tools, planks, and so on. Yeah. But we've done okay. I think we're doing all right. Our tavern is in. Um, we are burning through our berry brew, though, so I think it is a good idea um, to add in a berry brewery over here as well. Uh, it's just going to be a small one, I think. Um, we'll just have... Let's have the balcony one over here. At the back, we'll bring it up one step so we've actually got a balcony. Um... Our soldiers have returned. I sent them off on an easy mission, so hardly a surprise. Um, a door would be useful, wouldn't it? Let's have a refined entrance. Uh, we need a chimney. Uh, let's go for a roof chimney on there like that. That's all we need. Let's get that built. Okay, our... Whoops. Our dormitories up here. If I can get them in shot, there we go, are complete. Uh, so that's up to our um, capacity for, for monks and nuns to, where are we? 64. Uh, so we can get another couple in. Um, we still need another, um, what, eight cooks. Yeah. That, that, that was a bit excessive, making the um, kitchen that big, definitely. Never mind. Never mind. So the next thing we're going to want to look at probably is going to be the Hospitium. Um, and I think we'll probably have that around this side. Spreading off of the back of the refectory and the um, scriptorum and all of this. What's this building? Oh, that's our emissary office. That's right. But I think we'll leave it there for this episode. I think we're doing okay. Uh, oh, uh, update. I should have said at the start. We haven't had a single uh, villager path blocked message during the recording of this episode, which has been, what, about an hour and a half, two hours, something like that. We haven't had a single message, so it looks like this is, for the first time, working. Which I'm quite happy about. But we'll leave it there for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Please do give us a like and a subscribe if you've enjoyed it and you want to see more. Please give us any comments down below, and please join us next time. Until then... 
I've been John. This has been Foundation. Please do take care of yourselves, stay safe, and bye-bye.